Hey friends, Tyler Patner here. Today we're gonna to talk a little bit about some uh, good, better, best comparisons in the PCP world. Some things you can expect, some differences you can expect to see as well. So starting with your good option, uh, basically everything on the table here has an adjustable regulator, so you can adjust the power pretty readily uh, and easily. There are some other features involved here as we go up in price that you're gonna notice as well. Uh, so starting with your Air Venturi Avenger Bullpup, uh, obviously you have a side lever action, but a roughly $400 gun that has an externally adjustable regulator and externally adjustable hammer spring. So on the low end, it is really the only gun out there that gives you a lot of power adjustment at your fingertips. Um, but there is a lot of stuff that this gun doesn't do. The trigger is so-so. The cocking handle's back here by your face, so it's not the most ergonomically friendly. Um, but it does give you a lot of bang for the buck. Moving up a little bit in price to the Hots on Factor RC. Uh, this is a carbon fiber bottled, fully adjustable power PCP. You still have an externally adjustable regulator, you have a transfer port adjustment, and you have a hammer spring adjustment that is all right at your fingertips as well. Um, but a little bit better precision in terms of how the gun's put together, the build quality, fit and finish, than what you're gonna see on the Avenger. Now this is obviously a tactical styled gun versus the bullpup here that we have with the Avenger, but this is really what you're gonna expect to see as you go up in price. You know, more AR compatible parts, um, but you have a fully shrouded system. It's gonna be really accurate, relatively quiet, uh, and again, give you a lot of adjustment at your fingertips. Uh, what this gun won't do that our FX Impact, which represents the highest end of this kind of adjustable regulated range, is caliber interchangeability. So with FX, you not only get caliber interchangeability taking a 30 caliber gun maybe to a 22 or a 177, but you can also change barrel lengths at will and even change the barrel liners. So if you wanna to go to shoot a slug or something like that, you can certainly do that without too much trouble, uh, but still a fully adjustable uh, in terms of regulation. Uh, power adjustments are abound on all of these guns, but the impact is going to do it with the most precision that you can expect. And it is also going to have the best trigger, the smoothest action, highest mag capacity. There's a lot of stuff that you get when you buy a $2,000 PCP that you don't get when you buy a $1,000 gun. And there's a lot of stuff you get with the $1,000 gun that you simply don't get with the $400 gun. So it's something to consider. There's a level of fit and finish that I can tell you about, but you really have to handle to find out for yourself. Uh, but basically you have a good representation here on the table of guns that do very similar things, but achieve them differently and with different levels of quality and precision involved. Hopefully that's a good overview for you of what you can expect from a good, better, best perspective when you're looking at your PCPs out there because the things that we're talking about here apply across the board to all different kinds of PCPs as well, not just your adjustable ones. So something to keep in mind as you're taking a look on PyramidAir.com. Hopefully you found the video helpful today and uh, we will see you at the next one. Sound off in the comments and let us know which one of these you'll be picking up next.